Hi guys! So, as you all know, I don't really buy brand new G4 My Little Ponies, but I went to a car boot sale last weekend and came across these blind bag My Little Ponies, which were just £1 each, so I thought, why not? Um, I don't have a lot of blind bag ponies, because they tend to be harder to find than the brushables. It's on the second hand market anyway certainly at cheap prices, so I don't actually believe I've got any from this series yet, so. Now, I believe this is Series 18A, because in the UK the, the um, waves are split into two groups of 12 ponies, as you can see on the back of the packet here, whereas in the USA you get a single wave of 24 ponies. So this is the first half of the USA's Wave 18, which in the UK is Wave 18A, as I've already said. Now, the packaging design is exactly the same as it's been since Wave 16, I believe, which is why it's so confusing to know which series is which. You've got a picture of Twilight Sparkle's cottage on the front there. Um, or is it her library? <laughs> Whatever. Um, and it's decorated for Halloween with little cauldrons and lanterns and things. And you've got Mr. and Mrs. Cake dressed up for Halloween, along with Twilight Sparkle, who is dressed as Star Swirled Bearded, I believe. So, as I said, you've got 12 ponies in this series. Um, got Applejack, one of the main six, and also Fluttershy. But the other characters are all different. So you've got Royal Riff, Sassaflash, Comet Tail, Sprinkle Medley. Sorry, it's really hard to get this on the screen. But Gardenia Glow, Princess Cadence, Mr. Carrot Cake and Golden Harvest, Ribbon Wishes and Flower Wishes. Now, I only managed to get five of these. I picked them up off of the stall almost as soon as they'd been put out on the table and another woman came flying up and wrestled me for them, desperately trying to get them out of my hands, shouting, She's got all the ponies! I kid you not, that was actually what this woman shouted. She went a little bit hysterical and she asked the seller if she had any more, which luckily the seller did have three more, which she gave to this woman which got her off of my back, and so I was allowed to keep my five packets without being murdered. But obviously, since I've only got five, I'm not going to get a complete set here. But let's just open these up and see which ponies we have got. I'm going to try and move the card up there so it doesn't get damaged. I have a feeling I should have brought scissors. As usual. No, it's okay. Can open up the packets. So. And we have number three, Applejack. She is friendly and sweet. And these ponies are translucent and glittery, but they're different to the earlier, I think, wave three, which were covered in glitter, which came off on your hands. These ones, the glitter is actually inside the plastic. Which is really pretty, actually. So we've got Applejack. He's going to be in bag number two. Hopefully they're all in the same box, in which case we should have five different colors. My goodness, they don't make them easy to open, do they? But I suppose it's good for shoplifting reasons. Some of the earlier waves I used to see empty bags and the people had taken the ponies out. And then we've got Golden Harvest. Just creased that card up a bit. Oh well. She loves sharing. I, again, I do have an earlier Golden Harvest. This one's number seven. But not a translucent glittery one. Uh, 
I love the blind bag ponies. I think they're actually nicer than the brushables in some way. And they're a lot smaller to collect. You can get more of them on the shelf. Oh, who's going to be next? I really hope that I get the cadence because she's and Comet Tail would be nice because they're different um, body types to blind bags I've had in the past. I'm just going to move you two out of the way because I'm just hurting you here. Not that you can hurt a bit of plastic, but no. He makes up songs, don't we all? We all love to uh, have a good sing song in the shower. This is definitely my kind of pony with the treble clefts on there. Need more musical ponies in my life. Oop. Applejack does not want to stand up. Just get drunk on all that side as he drinks. Definitely should be scissors for this job. Blind bags never used to be this hard to open when I was buying them in the early waves. We must have trade with somebody and never got my heart to trade, so I think that was what put me off of um, collecting one of my old friends. He turned out to be not such a great friend. But we won't go down that avenue. Oh, and then we've got Flutter Shy, so we've got the other character from the main six. This is number five. She takes care of her friends. The only thing I don't like about them is they don't have differently coloured hair, the translucent ones. So. Not that they're not so cute, but they're not um, show accurate, I think. But, um, they don't look like they're television sold. Who are we going to have in here? It's a blue pony that looks good. Ah, it's Sprinkle Medley. She loves guessing games. Number one. Now, I don't actually know what the story of this one is. I don't know why she has these strange eyes. I'm guessing she's supposed to be spooky or something. Since it's in a Halloween packet. Um, with the name Sprinkle Medley, she's actually got the same colours as G1 Medley, but she's not a Pegasus. And she's got a little cloud for her cutie mark, which is really hard to see because you've got the light from the windows creating glare there. But I'm not quite sure what it's Sprinkle Medley because she's got no music notes like the G1 version. But there you go. So, five ponies from the. My Little Pony Wave 18A Blind Bag set. Now, I just have to hope that that store holder has more of these in future because I think I think they were pretty good for a pound each. I have to wonder where she gets her stuff from because she has a lot of My Little Pony merchandise, brand new, probably falls off the back of Flores, but uh, <laughs> I'm not responsible, so... I'm just going to enjoy them and pretend that they were purchased legally somewhere. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this video, and please give me a thumbs up. 
and comment below. Tell me all about your blind bag collections and also which of these five little cuties is your favourite. And I will speak to you all very, very soon. Bye!